So I got sent this portable monitor for review and I thought to myself, what's that for? And then I realised it's for flipping everything. I think one of the most exciting applications for something such as this is something that I predicted years ago in a conversation with my brother. I told you, brother. I told you. And I was completely wrong. So the idea that I had was that in the future we'd all have these tiny little computers and we'd plug them in uh, to screens at work. And that would be our computer and we'd be able to just operate our tiny little computers using the mouse and keyboard at work. Um, and I thought we'd take that home and we'd plug it into our screen at home and that would be our computer at home. Um, that is kind of coming true, so maybe I'm not completely wrong. This is a screen that you can connect your mobile phone to, and if you connect a Bluetooth keyboard and mouse to your phone, you'll have a tiny computer that you can plug into a screen, and it's flipping brilliant. Check this out. So the first time I plugged my mobile phone into the monitor, I was like, what the hell is that? That's a full-blown computer out of nowhere. Um, so I connected my Bluetooth mouse and keyboard up and started poking around, and look, that's a spreadsheet. Uh, that's Google Sheets, but it's a full-screen, full-blown version of it. So I started doing math and formulas and stuff, and quickly realised I'm not at work. Why the hell am I doing that? So I stopped doing that, opened up Google Chrome, and to my amazement, once again, full-screen version of Google Chrome with all the tabs and everything. My phone is basically mimicking Chrome OS. I can take any application that is on my phone, but utilise it in full-screen, just like I'm using a PC uh, or a laptop. Um, I can browse around, I can open YouTube videos, and the YouTube video opens in a separate window which I can expand and then just watch. I have all of the best aspects of having a full-blown computer, but also on top of that, this is still a mobile phone. Which means that one, it fits in my pocket, but two, I can load up my mobile phone apps, such as my camera. How weird is that? Look, look, <laughs> that's my stupid face. Yeah, excitement, yeah, wait! Don't get too excited yet. Unfortunately, what you've just witnessed is a very specific piece of software called Samsung DeX. And Samsung DeX only exists on the S8 and above. Um, you can do this with other third-party software as long as your phone has the capability to output HDMI signals via its USB cable in the first place, of course. Um, and so it's not definitely not going to work, but you might want to do some research before you rush out and buy a screen. So back to the screen itself then, we're living in the future. I keep saying this every week because something weird happens every week, but I never thought I would be able to take something like this out of its case and just plug something into it and it go, oh hello. I mean, it doesn't say, oh hello, that would be weird. But you can plug anything into this thing and it seems to just automatically detect the thing and the thing seems to automatically detect it. But I plugged it into my PC and my PC went, oh, a third monitor. And everything just started working. I could just drag stuff to it. Um, I've plugged my phone into it and like I said, it went, oh, do you want Samsung DeX now so you can turn your phone into a PC? And I went, yeah, I guess. So I plugged my camera into it and my camera immediately put a signal out to it and finally I can see everything in a decent size and colour and contrast rates and set my footage so it looks good. So I plugged it into my missus's Xbox and there it was, the Xbox, and I could play the Xbox. This thing is like mind-blowing and again I don't know if this thing is mind-blowing but technology is blowing my mind right now and I'm very happy about it.
<laughs> this is weird, right? I'm still finding things out whilst I'm filming. Because I thought I'd got everything in my brain and I knew what I was saying, and then I suddenly thought, hang on a minute, I haven't tested the audio output jack from the screen. So I thought, I'll just grab my headphones, I'll plug my headphones into this thing, I'll plug my phone in, I'll load up Netflix, and I'll come back to you guys and say, it worked, or it didn't work. It works great, so that's not completely surprising. So the headphones work okay when you plug them in. You can use a separate set of speakers, that's all good. That's not what's weird. What's weird is, I suddenly realized as I pulled the audio jack out, Nothing else other than my phone was connected to the screen. My mobile phone's battery was powering the monitor. <laughs> what? I don't understand. How can that be? But even weirder, if I plug a power supply into the other side of the monitor, the monitor charges the phone. <laughs> So, you've got ultimate versatility. In a pinch, if you want to power the monitor with your phone, ridiculously you can do. But, if you want to do it the other way around and get the thing to charge your phone up whilst you're using the phone, you can do that too. Ridiculous. Some stats, if you like stats. I'm not a big stats guy. And the reason is because the industry ruins statistics for us. Clarity. Precision, elegance, unparalleled beauty. With a gajillion megapixels and an 8K display, this potato is everything. Everything you buy nowadays is like, oh, it's a billion pixels and it's got this and it's got that and you buy it and it's rubbish. These things are so easy to skew, I don't trust them unless someone that I trust told me they were good. Uh, this is a good screen. Um, it's 1080p and that's plenty of pixels for something that is only this big, it's tiny. Uh, so if you like the whole stats thing, great. If you like me, it's 1080p and it looks pretty good. Um, this thing is... Yeah, I'm not tiny. Well, I am tiny, I'm like 5 foot 5. But this is not a mobile phone screen protector. This is a ridiculously big screen protector for that screen. Um, so it comes with that, it comes with cables, uh, it comes packaged with love. Um, I am a big fan of this screen. It comes with all the things it should come with and it does its job perfectly. I think I've covered everything apart from the uh, protective fold away cover thing. So that can be origami folded into a different shape so that you can angle the screen differently. I think there are two or three different shapes you can make. It's basically just like a tablet cover, only massive. Uh, it covers your screen, of course, so it is giving some protection. But if that's not enough protection for you, use this giant mobile phone screen protector. Uh, that's about it. Um, if I haven't covered your questions, you can scream at me in the comments section, like I have done something to hurt your mother. Uh, that's what usually happens, I would prefer it if you were civil. Um, if I haven't covered everything, if there are things you want me to plug into this thing, just let me know in the comments. Um, that is it, I hope you've enjoyed this video, if you have, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see some more of this guy, hit that subscribe button and ding that bell. Uh, dinging the bell lets YouTube know that you want to be notified when I upload stuff, and the thumbs up tells YouTube's algorithms that was a good video, and more people should see it. Uh, these are my patrons from Patreon, and I cannot thank them enough. They are the best people in the world. If you want to be one of these people, you can do that at either Patreon, or buy me a one-off beer at PayPal, and either way, I'll love you forever. Uh, these are my social medias, my Facebooks and my Twitters and my Instagrams. You can come and join me there and we can be best friends and I'll make you laugh, I promise. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye. It doesn't really matter what it weighs because I can, I can hold it with my baby penis. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, kids watch this show, don't say that. Yeah, excitement, yeah, oh, wait! Don't get too excited yet. Uh, this, <laughs> that's just, I seem like, I, 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 I seem to be being a moron. I should shut that door in case Nisha hears me being a moron. Every time I plug something into this thing, I bash my microphone like a big knobhead. Um, if you want to know what this weighs, it doesn't matter what it weighs. I'm taking too long to put that back. Start again. And connect a Bluetooth, 
A bluetooth. Bluetooth isn't a thing. Bluetooth. <laughs>